Hey, I'm sorry that I'm late. I was running a little late. There you go, you wanna look through there? Yeah. They're the same. I thought they were different, but they're the same. Okay, that's so fine. I figured you were gonna sell them or trade them or something. Yeah, you know, probably. And, uh. They come with people, different people on them. Spill it out here, buddy. There's all the PlayStation 2 games, that's one Xbox game, and the memory cards, and that. Okay. That game. And the rest of the games. I threw these in here. I Those took pictures of them, and I don't play them anymore, so. Yeah. They're newer games, so. Well, all right. Thank you very much. No problem. You come across some more. Maybe I'll find yeah. some more. Yeah. I think that's every bit of mine. All right. Well, thank you very much. Yeah. If I come across, I spoke to have another weed, but I can't find it. Okay. I'm thinking that my, his dad might have kept it at his apartment. Okay. Sure. All right. No, he didn't. He don't have a weed. Well, we gotta find. If we find it, I'll holler at you. All right. Well, thank you very much. You. you have a good day. What's going on guys, this is Toga here coming at you with another episode of Game Finds. Um, ignore the shirt, uh, it's really hot, um, I know I've got a farmer's tan and it doesn't look that appealing but it's, I live in the south in Alabama, it's really hot and plus I was working outside on my car audio. So there's that, but I'm going to come at you with another episode of Game Finds because uh, I haven't done one in like 3 or 4 weeks and school is picking up which means I'm going to have less and less time to actually go out and find stuff. So the stuff I have found has been over the course of like three weeks-ish. And so I'm just going to show you guys some stuff that I picked up. First off, I've got like a Sony PS1 adapter. This is like off-camera, not really significant enough to pick up uh, or show video. But uh, yeah, it's for the PS O and E, PS1, uh, the later model. So that's really cool. Found out for like 50 cents or a dollar. Uh, I also found a Guitar Hero mic for it. It says $3.99 on it, but 
Uh, probably paid like a dollar or something. Uh, I don't know. Didn't didn't spend a lot on it. Uh, another thing I spent like a dollar on was a Rocket Fish um, Xbox 360 component cable uh, with RCA also on there. Uh, these are in really good condition, and they're not they they're coated uh, with some protective wear there, so these are not going to go out. Uh, that was really cool for like a dollar or something like that. Uh, the next find, um, which is actually pretty awesome, would be the uh, the two controllers I found. These were like two bucks each, um, and so I'll show you guys that. Uh, first, we have a GameCube controller for two bucks. If you can see the tag right there, probably not. Yeah, right there, two bucks, maybe not. Well, just trust me, it's two bucks. Really good condition GameCube controller. And then like an off-brand Nintendo 64 controller with all the buttons in the joystick surprisingly working so I can just throw this in with another N64 bundle and make it like a tad bit more valuable I guess. Two bucks. Not a whole lot to fit on that. Uh, the next one, which is actually pretty cool, I got NCAA Football 14 for the Xbox 360. Uh, disc only, but still these uh, are actually quite valuable for sports games. I think I looked uh, online and you sell north of 20 bucks uh, NCAA football 14 for the 360 north of twenty dollars so if you ever find this sports game right now in uh, late 2015 it's going for that much online or in stores so keep your eyes out for that one uh, the next set of stuff I found um, would be these two things I got like a an Xbox 360 controller Energizer, uh, like uh, wireless charger. Uh, it had a white tag on it, so it was like a, do a dollar. Since it was, it was like uh, it was on a Monday at the store, and so it's uh, it, this, this, their store works is they got special things for each day, and uh, they have a fifty percent off tag uh, thing each day, and so it'll be like white the next day, green two days later, and so on Monday when you go in. And you find uh, if the white tag matches the the uh, tag that that's on sale, then uh, you get it for 99 cents. So 99 cents for this. And I also found a Wii as is uh, for five bucks as well with the composite cables. Um, even if this thing doesn't work, it's still pretty awesome. Just to find that, um, it's got a nice Mad World sticker on the very back. Which I'm covering up. So there's that. Um, in total, in six bucks for this. Pretty, pretty awesome. The next stuff would be a just just a lot of games I found. Um, first would be Wii Sports. This is complete Wii Sports. These have gone down in value, but still keep your eyes out for these. If you can find it for two bucks, they're at least worth ten, maybe. Uh, next one is Steel Diver for 3DS. Uh, I didn't know if this was going to be valuable. I only paid like two bucks for it, so um, took a chance. Not worth that much really, but 3DS is you know pretty popular, so I don't mind keeping it or trading it off or something. Uh, the next one is Just Dance for Wii, and I didn't have this one, and I think we own all the Just Dances except for the first one, so I picked it up just because you know why not. Gonna be keeping it. Uh, the next several stuff is pretty awesome. Um, you're going to be kind of shocked at what I should be next, but I've got Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2009, PGA Tour 11, uh, and 12 and 13. So, PGA Tour 12 and 13. You're asking me why did I buy T Tiger Woods PGA Tours? It's because Interestingly enough, these are still valuable. Not the 09 one, I don't know why I picked that one up, but the later years, the 13 one is still valuable, maybe like 10 bucks. And if I bundle these off, I can get a pretty good value for it. I think I spent like maybe like 2 bucks per game, maybe 3 for the Xbox 360. Spent 25 bucks for this whole lot. And then the next two games we're showing you are uh, Toy Story 3 for the 360. And the last one, which is pretty awesome to find, honestly, is uh, Portal 2. Uh, I, I don't see this one too often, so I picked it up when I could, and it's not that bad. So, that was that uh, 
lot right there, and then the, the last one I'm going to show you is a lot that I got off Craigslist. It's the same guy that I got um, all the big stuff from, the big Super Nintendos and the NES and the PS, like the big box of stuff a few episodes ago. I was the same guy, and I traded him more Legos, a big box of Legos for it again, and so uh, I'm just going to be showing off what I got. It's not as spectacular as the last time, but still, I wanted to treat him right. He wanted to treat me right. We both traded off games and stuff like that. So, I'll get started. First, starting off with a Wii balance board. And what's interesting about this is it's got like two little stands. You can, uh, it's got stands for it, and it's got like some connector pieces. So you can uh, connect this and set the Wii balance board on top of this thing. Um, I can't really show you because it has to like sit on the ground and stuff, and it's really big, so I'm not going to show you that. But it, trust me, it does, it does do that. Uh, getting more into the other games and stuff. Uh, I got two Skylanders swap teams. I don't know why he had these. Maybe because he was for his grandkid or something. But he had these, uh, brand new. So I guess that's cool. Not really. Um, two PlayStation 2 memory cards, which leads you to believe what I'm going to show you next is PlayStation 2 stuff. And you would be right. Uh, we've got. Jaws Unleashed, Scarface, which is actually a valuable one, not that valuable, but at least 10 bucks, I think, uh, Civil War and Nation Divided, Destroy All Humans, uh, Lego Star Wars, the original trilogy, and then SingStar 80s. And then God of War, and then God of War 2, the complete disc set. So it's got the uh, normal disc right here, and then the bonus feature disc. This is really cool to get those. The only X original Xbox game I got was Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Of all the Xbox games, this is the, probably one of the ones you want to get if it's the only Xbox one, because these are really sought after for the original Xbox. So there's that, no manual, but it's still cool to me. Um, a few 360 games. Uh, we've got Battlefield 3. We've got Battlefield Bad Company 2. We've got Dead Island Special Edition. We also have Battle Stations Midway. And then probably one of the most expensive ones in this is Spider-Man Edge of Time. So that is pretty good for that. And the rest of these are going to be Wii titles that are just junk. So I'm going to go through those really fast. Um, biggest Loser. Don't really care. Your Shape. Don't really care. My Fitness Coach. Don't really care. <clears throat> Boogie Superstar. Don't really care. Ooh, Call of Duty 3. Still kind of don't care, but better than the rest of them. Uh, Fantasy Aquarium World. More not caring. Uh, Pirates. The Hunt for Blackbeard's Booty. So, kind of interesting. Blazing Angels. Squadrons of World War 2. Not caring. Balloon Pop. Still not caring. Uh, and then probably some of the, the Wii tiles are pretty good. Uh, Wii Music, uh, not really expensive to find, but it, it's definitely fun to play around with a bunch of people because you can play uh, any instrument and it's really fun. Uh, Wii Fit, that would go along with the Wii Balance Board. And then the last one is Wii Play. So that's all the Wii stuff. Not too spectacular of a game, but I do have one more game to show you that he threw in, which is really awesome. It's a Game Boy game. Um, it's Kirby's Dream Land 2. Now, what's really interesting about this is I've been looking for the first original Kirby's Dream Land for the original Game Boy, and it's not expensive at all. It's only like five bucks, and I've never been able to find it. I found the manual. But I've never found the game in the wild. I had it as a kid, and then I lost it or something. And if I 
now I have Kirby's Dream Land 2, and I'm just like, I can't find the first one. But it's really cool to find Kirby's Dream Land 2. So, that's all for this video. And I know it's kind of short, but I got time to make it now, so that's what I'm going to do. So, uh, you know, feel free to go watch the other episodes. And, um, you know, I'll leave it up to that. And uh, thanks, guys, for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.